How's it going guys? Today we have another deck review, another Trial of the Gods deck review and this one's a good one. So basically we have finally our chosen one deck that we're gonna be testing out. It has a really interesting spread in terms of cards because we only have two creatures in our deck and the whole goal of it is to bring Osiris as the chosen one to the top of the deck and to play it and since Osiris gets to keep its buffs you're always going to keep buffing the chosen one so even if he kills it the first time then the second and the third times it's pretty much impossible for you to kill it so we only have two creatures which are the Osiris and we have Triumvirant uh, Prophet because that's the legendary card that allows you to bring the chosen one to the top of the deck. So let's look at the deck list here. Uh, there's only one card we don't have um, because we didn't have uh, the card from our card pack opening, um, which is the Etheric Alarm, which is a really good card, by the way. Uh, but we supplemented it with uh, two other cards that I'm going to talk to you about. So in the one mana slot, we got two reformations that can be used, uh, are, are supposed to be used on the opponent's creatures. We have Dowsing Plate, uh, which uh, together with your God Power always brings stuff, the, um, the chosen one, to the uh, two cards closer. So if you keep using this and your God Power, you're bringing in five cards closer. So on average, it's gonna take you uh, about five turns to get the chosen one. Uh, but uh, it's going to be much quicker because you have other ways of doing it. Then we have Ritual Rod. We have uh, Theoric Blessing, which not only allows you to buff your chosen one, but it also allows you to draw a card if that's the case. You need to draw cards to get the chosen one faster. Then in the two mana slot, uh, we have uh, two Vow of Champions. Uh, probably going to use this for drawing cards, um, but you can also use it to deal to damage, for example. And then we have Halloween Light, which sheds a creature health to two. If you choose a friendly creature, you give us it plus two health. And one of the first cards we have here that the, is not in the original deck list, um, and we changed it for from uh, Etheric's Alarm, Etheric Alarm to this, uh, is we have one Anoint, which doubles the health of a friendly creature. So imagine having a chosen one with 10 health, you double it to 20. <laughs> and this is gonna be freaking bonkers, man. Um, then in the three mana slot, uh, the other card that we substituted for the Etheric Alarm, we put one Golden Harpy. So you wanna have the, those protections in order to survive until you get the chosen one. Then we have Osiris, the whole key to this, uh, to this combo. Uh, we have Parthian Democracy. Uh, we have Fated Arrival, which is the new card from Trial of the Gods, which allows you to draw the chosen one directly from your deck, and you give it Ward and Frontline. So once you have Frontline in Osiris the first turn, it's always going to have Frontline, and you're going to have like a chosen one that's like 20 health or something like that. It's going to be pretty hard for them to deal with. I, th I think the only counter to this deck is going to be um, uh, Ratify, which turns the, the card into a red. That's going to be pretty bad if that happens. But other than that, we're fine against everything else. Even if they kill it, it just goes back to the deck and we keep buffing it. Um, uh, the trial begins... Um, uh, is essentially the same thing as Fated Arrival. It allows you to pull the chosen one uh, from your deck to your hand. So right now we have, uh, and, and then we have Triumvirant Prophet, the other uh, creature. And this also brings it to the top of your deck. So essentially we have five ways. One, um, one, one sixth of a chance of drawing the chosen one directly, plus the fact that it's coming to the top of the deck quickly with all of the other cards. Then we have White Levy, two of them, and then we jump on to uh, five mana, where we have Inquisitor Summons, because we want to stall as much as possible against the opponent, and we have Canonize, because if we buff the chosen one and we give it protected, then um, it's going to keep its buffs once it dies, okay? Um... And then we have two purification filters because you want to like, uh, I'm guessing like at turn six or uh, uh, at six men or seven men is when your the game basically ends because that's when you're summoning Osiris that's super buffed and they're just gonna concede. Um, so this is the deck list and I think this is gonna be pretty awesome unless we go against um, a magic deck which runs Redify which is very, very rare nowadays in the current meta, we're gonna be fine. 
Um, so let's jump right into the games and see how fun this deck is. I've, I've been I've been waiting for this deck for so long. I wanted to play a good chosen one deck. So let's jump right in. Okay, so uh, we run this with Chosen Visions, of course. And we're going up against Onslaught, Onslaught War, which is pretty good. Uh, I think we're going to keep this. Yeah. Okay, so... We're going to play this on turn 1. Uh, the Afterlife, uh, it gives the Chosen 1 plus 2 plus 2. A plus 1 plus 1. And we're gonna play this next turn, and then the other turn uh, we're gonna draw it and and put it on the on the board. The turn afterwards. So as you can see, this is like we have the chosen one right away. Okay, so that would be uh, we don't need this. Oh, this allows you to look at the top cards, two cards of your deck. Yeah, nice. Okay, next turn we play this. Sure, it doesn't matter. It's already buffed, so we drop this guy. And we have Black Wolf Blast, Fall of Champions, Pride of Giants. I think we're gonna drop the Pious Giants because we don't need uh, any favor. So it's gonna be fine. Okay, so next turn uh, we have Osiris with uh, plus four, plus four. Yeah. And then let's just buff it. Why not? <laughs> the 9 10 on turn 4. <laughs> With Ward. <laughs> <It's just laughs> oh my god. Yeah, yeah, sure. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Just keep the buffs, go back into the deck. Okay, um, I think I'll use Light Slavy, and then... I'll use this. <laughs> it's 9, 10, it's 11, 12, right now. We're gonna use this and this one together next turn. Oh my god. Yeah, yeah, sure. Buff your car the cards in your hand. Why not? Okay, not yet. It's fine. It's gonna bring it to cards closer. So at the end of each turn, it, it moves the um, two, two cards closer. So we just keep playing this every turn is five cards. That should be fine. Uh, he's going to give it, okay. This is fine. Yeah. Well, it's a 15-16 <laughs> right now. Oh, God. <laughs> Do you have another lethal <laughs> deadly card? He keeps the wards, man. <laughs> I, I told you. For second, second drop of the chosen one, you, you can see it. Let's go. Second game. Oh, God. Perfect. <laughs> 
Uh, yeah, we're gonna keep this. So, pay ah, by the way, I forgot to tell you guys, this text call, uh, is made by Green Guy and it's called Osiris Chosen One Meme. Because this is absolutely, like, meme-tastic. Like, what the hell? Uh, Dionysi Bowl ru Rune Viper Tincture, probably. Yeah, yeah, sure. Okay, so I think I'm gonna draw it right away. Yeah. <laughs> you have the chosen one, like as soon as you get to turn three. <laughs> this is bonkers, man. I can't believe this is happening. Ward and frontline, yeah. You know he's gonna concede, right? And I'm gonna give like, I'm gonna pick this at one health and one attack. Yeah, sure. End the turn, please. Cause I, I just wanna finish the game. Oh, he's putting stuff in the, in the deck. Yeah, forgot about that. Yeah, yeah, sure. Oh, this is not the chosen one. Damn it. Oh, it's still fine. Give it ward and frontline. Okay. I just need to be careful now because it's 3-4 three, three, so we can kill it. So I'm going to have to be careful about it. Um... You know, I want to do this. I want to do this. And I want to do this. Okay, so. Once I summon it, this is going to become a 6 7. And then I'll just uh, play the Chosen Visions together with this. So, hopefully, it's fine. Yeah, sure. Might as well do that on this one than on the other one. Oh, yeah, yeah. First, first we do Inquisitor Summons. Yeah. I think let's do... Hopefully, I'm not screwing up. Oh, Light Slavy, okay. Well, if I get another Inquisitor Summons, that's pretty good. Well, it has Ward uh, and Frontline. So he's gonna have to go through this, yeah. Okay, so let's do this. Roar, buff it. Okay. Oh, the problem is we're gonna draw Osiris next. It's pretty terrible. Well, it doesn't have a way to kill this, so. Especially because it has ward, so it does have twenty three. Oh, we can take soul shatter. Yeah, I forgot about this. Because this costs three or less. Ooh, okay. Oh, this is perfect, right? Okay, so we first use Purification Filter. That should uh, wipe 
uh, the part clean. Let's see if this works. No, it didn't work, so... Well, at the most, I'll use purification filter to get rid of the board. Okay, so this happened because we buffed the wrong one. Enemy creature with the least health, okay. But this should kill any, everything either way, so. Purification filter this. Okay, so. Purification filter. Should clean everything. I'm not sure if this happens, uh, but uh, I think next turn it's gonna happen. So we need to play Chosen Visions, Golden Harpy, because we, we need to stall. Okay, so we need to play Golden... Wait, 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 wait. I can't, we can't play Golden Harpy. We need to play this. We need to play Chosen Visions. And we need to heal our gods for four. Okay. It doesn't have front line yet, so. Okay. That's the issue right now. It doesn't have front line. Can we survive this? Okay, he took Run Viper Tincture, so he shouldn't take a social idea anymore. Well, actually, I think this is even better, because we do this. And we remove to durability. We put this one on. And we give it plus one health. And then next time we'll summon the Arc Lights, okay. Even if he goes face full, just summon the uh, Acolyte. We need to give it frontline. That's the issue. Like if he's clever, he's gonna just gonna keep going face. But I think I'm gonna get rid of this and uh, start with the Golden Harpy because we need to we need to survive. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so first we do Inquisitor Summons. And then we start getting rid of stuff. Okay. Okay, first Inquisitor Summons and then we go with the rest. Okay. Um, Inquisitor Summons. Oh, never mind. We're gonna we're gonna deal two damage, and we're gonna place this here, and we're gonna get rid of this. This should be enough. Okay. Next time we start healing everything, uh, we buff this and we start buffing like the chosen ones, so it's fine. Okay. So you can't get a, get rid of everything. Okay. You're drawing, sure.
Okay, so this is actually pretty good because it's gonna start bringing stuff back. Okay, so first of all, Let's play these cards, summon something, heal everything up, should be fine. He has a bunch of cards, but we should be fine, especially because it's 14 cards in, in the deck, so even if this dies, I'm gonna get it back pretty quickly. Do you have another... Well, I'm just gonna buff it, though. Okay. Okay, so these two go here. Okay, this goes here because we want to bring something back. Uh. Uh, it doesn't actually matter. We're just gonna... Heal ourselves up. Okay, we're taking uh, 5 damage. Should be fine. Is he gonna kill it though? Well, we have a dowsing blade, so we're gonna get it back pretty quickly. Oh, well played! Oh, well played! Oh, he wins! Congrats to you, sir! Oh, weren't we getting Purification Filter? No, uh, it still doesn't help me. No, it's Light Slavery first. Yeah, we're getting Light Slavery first. Yeah. This is not going to help me. I could do this, but it doesn't matter. That's... Yeah, he has he has 10, 10 health. Uh, 10, 10 damage. Okay, well played, well played, well played. Still, like, this was a tough game for him. What's this? Lysander! Ooh! Good game, good game. Okay, so chosen ones. Okay, so we don't, we want to draw, we don't want to give chosen one to the big guy. Now this should be fine. Oh, we're going up against Forge. We're going to have all the time in the world. And we're definitely gonna buff it right away. Um, I think I shall use this. The thing is, I don't know which creature is buffed. Will I be able to know? Yeah, it's the chosen one.
Okay, so next turn we double this health. Actually, we have four, right? So two, three, plus two, five. Yeah, let's do this. It should be it sh it should be in the game because nature doesn't have a way to deal with this. Oh, okay. Still not enough damage. You're putting this at uh, okay. Okay, so we do this. We do this. And then we do this. And we trade against these. Oh, uh, I should go kind of against the goats. Because the goat deals too damage. Yeah, he's going to kill himself. Pretty much suicide by this point. At this point. Take Eric Blessing. I'm gonna use this one just in case. Oh burn! Nice, nice, nice. Doesn't actually matter though. Because I can outlast the burn. Um Okay, so we're definitely gonna get rid of the goat now. I think he's going to be able to kill this. Unless I get a full heal. Maybe we need a fully heal your creature type of spell. Oh, no. It's this one. And then this one, and then we trade this guy here, and we use this here. Wow, he's gonna be able to kill it. Draw a card, give plus one health to each card in your deck. Ooh, he's taking the damage. Nice. Okay, or eagle then. That is stupid. Okay. Okay, so we should be fine. Let's uh, let's let's just do chosen visions. And probably trial. I, I don't know. Oh, we don't need to draw it. Okay, uh, let's do this. Okay, so ideally I would use, oh, you just screwed yourself up, man. He's gonna attack with the weapon, right? You're gonna attack, right? Please attack. Please attack. Oh, you screwed yourself up. Okay, he's not gonna attack. Okay, that's fine. Uh, pa 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 pa. Okay, so we're gonna transform this into something that's ours and then we use this. This should be uh, six mana. The problem is we don't have frontline. We need a frontline, dude. Oh, it's gonna be pretty tough. Yeah, the issue is if we, I think we need to take this out. I think we need to do this wrecks the whole combo thing. 
Like both of the games we lost, it's because this one this was the chosen one. Like here there's nothing we could do right now. Like here, for example. Well, it's like a 50% chance. Okay, good. He's gonna trade. He's not gonna trade. Oh, yeah, yeah. Perfect. So that's the game again. Well, it doesn't actually matter because the way you have no way. Yeah, it's, it's like if this gets... If this is the chosen one, we are screwed. And we don't have a freaking frontline card. Oh god. This deals to damage to each friendly character. <laughs> okay, yeah. Let's use it. Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna try again, but uh, if this doesn't work, then I want to switch that uh, legendary card out. I think that's what screws it up. Okay, chosen one. Yeah, if it hits the legendary card, we're screwed. The whole point of this is the, the card keeping the buffs. Okay, so we don't need this right away, of course. Okay, let's just play this. Then next time we do chosen visions, the turn afterwards we give it frontline. Oh god. That is a bad start. Okay, at least it's not the that one. Good. Well whew. Um I would rather give it frontline though. Oh my god, it's this one. What the hell? We're gonna lose because of this. It's always because of this. No, at least we can draw the next one super quickly. This gives burn too, right? Yeah. Well, both of these guys die if he attacks. Bye, Bob. Oh, okay. That is fine. That's fine. Okay, so we just buff this. We try this here. We force him to to do that, and we'll keep. You know what I'll do? No. We're gonna keep things as is. Yeah. Because he's gonna kill this, so I'm gonna get a new chosen one. You have two of them? Oh god, come on. Talk about luck. You're giving it burn? Oh. 
Oh, come on. This is not fair. Um, okay, so this should be it. And we trade this here. It, it has front line, so it should be fine. So this is this, this, and this. Okay. Yeah, sure. Okay, so we attack this guy. We drop this. We buff it up. And we give it, well, it's not gonna help. Well, let's draw a card. Oh God, reformation here would be so good. <sighs> okay, he's gonna kill it, right? Okay, so we can just heal ourselves up then. Okay, never mind. Let's do this. And let's do this. And then let's do this. And then next time we play this into uh, one of these guys. Is it gonna give burn to its own creature? Probably. Oh wow, well, we can use reformation. Okay. Heal your god. Okay, so we're just gonna keep healing this guy up and buffing it. Well, we could do Inquisitor summons, it should be fine. Oh, perfect. This is even better. Heal my god. And then let's just buff this guy up. Oh, I could have attacked first. Well, it doesn't matter. Next turn we win. And that should be the game. And that should be the game. Nice. Okay, yeah. So I think the only change I would do would be to take out the legendary card um, that draws the chosen one, that moves the chosen one to the top of the deck. The thing is, that's the only card you have to give frontline to a card. Maybe you can substitute it by another card that heals your uh, uh, me, uh, your minion, your creature, and gives it frontline, for example. You could substitute it for that, because that's its function, essentially. And then you always, you're always you always guaranteed that you're gonna get the... Um, that you're gonna get the, the uh, Osiris as the chosen one, which should be fine. Um, that, that looks nice. Other than that, it's like two thumbs up, because this act's super fun. You just need to tweak it a little bit, but it's hella fun, man. Hella, hella fun. Guys, you make sure you go and try and create this deck because you need to try it out. It's super good. Uh, other than that, make sure you smash the like button if you like this deck review. And don't forget, there might be or might not be a question inside the video. You need to search for it. Uh, see you guys next time. Peace out. Bye-bye.